All right, guys. So picked up another Crash 350Z, like always, just for parts, but it's still neat to check them out. So at least I think it is. It's like my favorite part of buying some junk cars, like being able to go through it and see what the car has in it and what's what's done to it. But anyway, let's show you the car real quick. Yeah, pick this thing up. Um, I don't know. I really wish the wheels wasn't so jacked up. Like, I don't think there's like one wheel that didn't, or maybe like one rear wheel and one front wheel that that didn't get damaged. So, of course, this one I think is like a total write-off. I don't think that's going to be uh, fixable. <laughs> it's pretty screwed up. Dino, why are you so nosy? Why are you so nosy, Buffy? Jeez. So they got one good one right there. This one's not too bad. You can see it's a little, took a little nick, but it does look like it's the aluminum's cracking. So, but this was like a really, really nice car. There's not much like on the inside that's actually good. This carbon fender is freaking jacked up. <laughs> and that's like part of one of the intakes. Oh, jeez. Pretty gnarly. I'm gonna say that's a guardrail. It looks like a, like a guardrail, even like guardrail hype kind of. So I don't think anything's wrong with this wheel. It's in an okay shape. And just sit that back up there for right now. <laughs> but you never can tell with this this engine. I reached out to the the previous owner of it. He says that it has Tomei cams and ported lower and upper intake, but you never can tell. Um, but the stuff I can see, it has a full ISR exhaust and DC coilovers. Let me jack this thing up real quick so I can show you guys. Like I said, we have, like I was saying, we have like BCs, which is kind of cool. Yeah. You guys can see, but it said full exhaust. Um, yeah. Kind of bummer like so it has like isr headers and um the y and single exit exhaust and all that stuff which wish i'd have seen that before i put the exhausts on my car because it's just like some cheap ebay thing but anyway parts i'm definitely going to use door panel because <laughs> the parts car for my car like i said it got hit like right there where the door hinges are and it destroyed everything um, the dash bar itself Like the the inner bar structure because it's different from the DE car and the HR car So like my interior is fully put together, but this little piece right here. I can't really bolt it in because the dash bar is different Whew. So it'll definitely be a couple of little interior pieces. Um, and I'm probably, I'm probably gonna pull this, I don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't think it has cams in it, I'm gonna be honest. But I'm gonna pull this engine and see, just take the valve cover off, see if it has cams in it and stuff like that. Cause I was kind of hoping that, you know, the oil, the oil gallery gaskets were already done. And like I said, it has cams and intake stuff. That's gonna be dope, but I don't think any of that stuff's been done. 
just looking at it, it looks all stock to me. But you never know. I'm not gonna call anyone a liar or anything. We'll just dig in and check it out myself. It just kind of looks like somebody maybe did like, um, you know, valve cover gaskets and stuff like that. So, if anyone has one of these intakes, I need the passenger side, because like it's destroyed. I would greatly appreciate it. I'm willing to buy it if you have a crashed car with these intakes and the driver's side's messed up. I'll buy your passenger side or vice versa. If someone needs the driver's side, I'll sell it to you. So, but anyway, so yeah, the game plan is I'm going to take my car as is to the Dragon this weekend. I have to take the power steering pump off this car um, because I ended up smoking mine <laughs> For, because I was driving around so much with the power steering pump disconnected. So, my own stupidity <laughs> so i definitely need to steal the power steering pump off this thing um i'll probably keep those two back wheels for like drift spare days and then sell those factory z wheels that i have and i don't want my car to be loud but i think i'm gonna have to steal the headers and the y pipe and the exhaust off this car um i, don't know, I just like having like a full exhaust so anyway so that's gonna be pretty much the game plan with this thing um not saying it couldn't be fixed, I just don't see that it is worth fixing. So, we'll take a few parts off this thing. If there's any parts you need, let me know. Um, one of these swaps, transmission, and everything will be for sale. I just don't know if it's going to be the one out of my car or the one out of this car, but both engine, both these cars, the drivetrain and the cars themselves, they only have like 90 something thousand miles on it. I think this one is like 91 and mine's like 98 or something. So they're both under 100,000 miles, even just barely. So I'm going to be selling one of the engines and one of the transmissions. Like I'll do a full swap if anybody's interested. But our transmission, like a full manual swap. But yeah, I'm going to start. But this is what, as far as like the car content goes, this is pretty much what it's going to be. Just me showing you the stuff. And like I said, if, if I was still working a regular 9 to 5, I would probably end up HR swapping that G35 I just picked up because <laughs> like why not the car already looks cool it's got wheels big brakes and putting your HR in it that'd be dope but like I said I need some sort I need some form of income and since I don't want to go back to a traditional nine to five I'm going to be selling parts so selling parts and flipping cars is what I'm going to do until I something happens and I'm like okay I gotta go back to work and be an adult I don't know but for now that's just what we're gonna do. Dino agrees with it. He gets to hang out more, stuff like that. So, yeah, um, yeah, that's it. Like I, said, I just wanted to show you the car and stuff. And like I said, if if um, enough people care to see it, I'll actually start shit, you know making more videos like I used to, where it just shows like me going to go pick this junk up and all that stuff. But for now, it's just gonna be a quick little introduction. Like I said, you might see the G and this car again, like me taking parts off of them and stuff. I don't know, but. Yeah, but for now, that's it. <laughs> the next video, I'm almost confident that I'm gonna be taking my 350Z to the Dragon with no doors, no bumper, no front bumper, and just cruising around, having a good time. I'm gonna wait until, I'm hoping that Z1 is gonna do like something for Black Friday and I can pick up all the, the uh, oil gallery gasket stuff at a pretty good deal, so. For Black Friday, I'm planning on buying the stuff to get that sorted out with that car, which is not bad enough to where it's gonna hurt to drive it, so we're gonna drive it. But get that sorted out and buy coilovers for the Corvette, hopefully. So, and then take it for drift event. So, yeah, that's it, guys. That's it. I'll I'll quit rambling. We'll see you in the next one. Dino, what are you doing? What are you doing? Ah. What are you doing? Zoomies! <laughs>